What's up, everybody? My name is Barely Gamer. This on my right. <laughs> Hold on. Form an L with your hands. Which is left? Which is right? To the buckarina. <laughs> anyway. What's up, everybody? My name is Barely Gamer. This here on my right is J Dog, and we're gonna be playing Until Dawn. Now, this is a game that I played. A bit. I got to about, if this is in chapters, I think, like to chapter 3, chapter 4. Never really experienced the, uh, well, experience. And I don't think you, I mean, you watch cutscenes, but you haven't actually played this yourself, right? Yeah, um, I haven't actually uh, played this game myself, but I've, I've uh, spoiled myself a little bit, or more but or less. you haven't seen, like, the ending or anything. I haven't like seen the ending. So, it'll be, so, it'll it'll should be, be interesting. a new experience for you, too. So, I'm going to go ahead and start a new story, and we'll get rolling. Um, the one thing I obviously love about this, if anybody knows my love of, like, film actors, Peter Stormare does a phenomenal job in this game. Like, just phenomenal job as the creepy, uh, psychiatrist or whatever. He's just, he's just perfect for the fucking role. Yeah, yeah I'm just gonna have a lot of fun with this game, because <laughs> I love making decisions that affect the flow of the story. He is very indecisive. So am I, too, actually. Like, we're just... The smallest decision can dramatically change the future. Your actions will shape how the story unfolds. One man versus one butterfly. In a butterfly will win. Butterflies in the sky. I can fly twice as high. <laughs> Thank you, Reading Rainbow. LeVar Burton! Uh, sorry I'm a little late. <laughs> late to the party. Hey, did you see that? Yeah, there's a weird guy outside. Mm -hmm. Oh god, that guy's passed out drunk. Already? Already, the party just started. Really hit the stuff there, huh, Josh? I robot. Mm, the Pacific. I haven't seen him in many. Th uh, the first thing I ever saw Remy Malek in was uh, the War at Home. That's really going back. Right. You look so damn hot in that shirt, but I bet you're even hotter out of it. Ugh. Come to the guest room at two a.m. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out. I'll be your Freddie Prince oh. Jr. for this evening. This is. <laughs> Don't come. You're too young. Oh, oh yeah, it's a yeah, it's a prank. Oh, that is just cruel. Using a GoPro for evil. How dare you? Okay, what do you want to do? Wake Josh or find the others? Find the others. Find the others. Yeah, waking Josh seems a little hard right now. He's he's out like a light. He kind no of is. No point of waking him up. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, all right. So you gotta press the correct action button. This is a quick time event. Okay. Yeah, I hate these. But if you fail, you you probably die. Probably. Probably. So fast or safe? Safe. <clears throat> okay. Play it safe. Yeah. If you did fast, you have to do quick time events. <laughs> More quick time events. Yeah. Those are always fun. <laughs> yeah. All right. So we took we played it safe, and our sister's probably dead. Good job. Okay. I'm more concerned right now of my own life. My own well-being. Right or left? <laughs> what a decision! Okay, noise Follow or footprints? footsteps? Follow footprints. Yeah, now no, that's the first wise decision you made all night. What?! Oh, oh shit. hello. Maybe not a good idea. Uh, those were the footprints, I'm assuming. Then fuck shit. That's Tourette's there? Jesus, fuck shit! What is this on the ground? Oh god, I hate these things. Here we go, your first totem pole. Totems? Check it out. Ow. That's our future. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, hello. Yeah, oh. that's totally <laughs> natural. And continue to walk even more slowly. I think Bernie Sanders was over there. Oh, shut up. <laughs> oh, there she is. God, she must be freezing. Yeah. Emma. What are you oh, doing? God. Oh, exactly! <laughs> my, my thoughts, exactly! Yeah, you are, for running to the woods. Uh-oh. Let's go. Yeah. Quick time events. Really? Maybe. I forgot. It's been a while. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Wait a fuck up, Hannah. Oh, shit. Yeah, about 
Oh shit! Who the hell is that coming from? Okay, drop hand or let go. You gotta make a decision fast. Oh really? You're gonna let? Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, okay. You're well, just... No matter what happens, you're, she's you're dead die. anyway. Yeah. <laughs> See. Uh... Yeah. Okay, that's great. Cool. So great. we're we're awesome at yeah, this game. Yeah. So I just died you right just there. You murdered two girls, Jared. And now, Doctor Peter Stormare. Dr. A.J. Hill. Peter Stormare! Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. Mm -hmm. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this. What are you doing? <laughs> I just love Peter Stormare. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Get a little up close well, and personal. You have committed to commence with this game. What is this significant? And I want to help you see it through. Oh, thank you. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here Just to be like sure me. that no matter how upsetting things may be, I guess. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up cards? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. <coughs> uh, it's nice. That's, that's good. Is that your childhood home? Shh. How did that picture make you feel? How did it make you feel, Jerry? How did it make me feel? It makes me uneasy. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna say it happy. makes you happy. In what way did it make you happy? It makes me want to jump high. The sunshine, or it's peaceful. It's peaceful. It is not. It's scary. All by yourself. Now, what would you do? What was it asking? Would it scare you if you were all by yourself in there? Yes, it would, or no, it would not. Now, what are you gonna pick, Mr. Man? Yes, it would. <laughs> what? Yeah, there you go. That's honest. I love that! Oh, it's so happy! Is that your choice? I wouldn't care. Oh my god! You're a full of shit! I wonder what it is that does frighten you. Who wants to know? Isolation? Maybe? Being alone? Forever alone? Let's investigate that in our next session, shall we? Our next session? God, he's like he's... It's like he's uh, eating the scenery. But if you turn your back on him, he will replace you. Well, that's a... <laughs> that's an interesting intro. Yeah. You kill two girls and have to listen to the V-Dub guy. The guy's just done a lot of cool stuff. I've seen a lot of his movies. I love the way he acts. It's just... He can be either really cool or really fucking scary. Like in this. So... Is it, wait, is it Hayden Pattenair or Panettiere? Hayden Panettiere? Panettiere? Hayden Panettiere or Panettiere, leave your comments below. Rami Malek. Rami Malek, man, that dude's fucking badass. I said one of his first acting credits was The War at Home with, with um, Michael Rappaport. <laughs> Phenomenal show. Of course, now he's iRobot, so. Er. Is it iRobot? No. Oh my god, I'm gonna say iRobot. That's the fucking Will Smith movie. Mr. Robot. That is Rami Malek. He is Mr. Robot. Hi. Let's do that again. <laughs> He's like me. He's like you. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Alright, let's try this again. Hello, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I'm super excited to welcome all my pals back. After my the sister's annual died. Blackwood Winter Getaway. <laughs> <laughs> yep, definitely you. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together. Thinking of them. I really want to have, some quality. Could you have picked a different location other than the place where <coughs> they disappeared? Why not? Yes! 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 Yeah, I mean, I understand the significance of doing something where something bad happened, but couldn't we have gone to a Ramada or something? Like, why do we have to go back up to the same cabin? If they have the money, couldn't they go to somewhere tropical instead? Yeah, like, let's go to Hawaii for the anniversary, you know? 
I'm sure if we had more money, Beth and Beth and I almost said Beth and Phoenix. Beth. Beth. Diligent, considerate, adventurous. Sam, Hannah's best friend. Romance, desire. All right, so we climb gotta, over. Yeah, we gotta climb over. So let's use our Hayden Pen parkour. Parkour. I'm gonna go the. You know, I'm not gonna be a little bitch. I'm going on the quick route. Let's do Fine. it. Fine. Do all the uh, quick time quick events. Quick time events. Oh shit. Uh, 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 no, no, no. Okay, okay. I forgot which which controller. You have to... ah! <laughs> Click. Don't move. On. Keep the wireless control as still as possible. Oh shit. Not moving. That, that's kind of cheating. I don't care. I fed Setting the Setting it on a table. I fed the squirrel, okay? That's all that matters. Loss. Brown but butterflies foretold tragedy affecting friends. Guys that's racist. Offered visions to help and guide. Fortune. White butterflies brought dreams of luck and good fortune. So let's try to get the white butterflies. Alright, let's... Can I, can, I, can I pick it up? I want to pick it up. As you explore, you can discover two of the artifacts. Pick me up. John. What, what do I hit? Okay, there we go. All right, so R2 to pick up, yep, and then turn. Yep. Okay, let's see what it is. That looked like a good one. I it's got a guidance it. totem. Okay, cool. I got guidance. <clears throat> I, I like it. I like it. Futures on whether or not the prophecy comes true depends on the choices you make. What prophecy? A bird flies in a room? <laughs> what, what, what's that? That bird might ultimately <laughs> affect your future, Sean. <laughs> it carried with it a... Maybe a key. <laughs> a key, yeah. Ah, Harry Potter reference. You didn't even realize it was. I didn't even realize it. <laughs> it's the winged keys. Uh. No. Oh well, come on, fine. Come on. You know I'm not gonna. You know you go the goody sh two shoes. Because back. a butterfly effect appears when your actions are changed. All right, there all right, fine. Game. We got a white butterfly. Oh, that no. one. <laughs> yeah. Ah. Uh. Man, I don't even need a license for this baby. Welcome to Florida. Yeah, let's lock ourselves in. That's cool. Yeah. Make sure no one follows us. You fell into my trap. It's raping time. Alright. That would be a bad butterfly fact. <laughs> that would be. Guess we gotta wait. We could have gone there. The hotel and sanatorium. That'd be cool. Going to a sanatorium? Yeah! Yeah, let's hang around with the insane. Right, let's do it. <laughs> Why is it a hotel in Sanatorium? It's like, have a crazy, crazy-ass time. Okay. Yeah. Why is it a hotel in Sanatorium, though? Let's talk about that for a second. Who mixes those two? It's like, I've heard of a hotel and spa, hotel and casino. Oh, hello. Picture of a tub. That's okay. not creepy at all. Oh, shit. Is that the cabin? I guess so. Or is that the cable car station? Mm. There's something over there, I think, no? Nothing in the core? Nothing but a bull. Or bison, we'll or whatever, take it by the whatever, tr whatever trophy that is. Ha ha ha. What? What no. kind of prom is that? <laughs> what proms have you gone to? <sighs> Friend zoned. At the prom. <laughs> the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. What? Okay, so. Why make him move? So I got moved to the back. And. Ten next to Josh. That's how we're yeah. So without that bra strapping, <laughs> would not have happened. You should thank that guy. <laughs> you should thank that bra strapping pervert child. <laughs> what the hell? The butterfly effect. <laughs> yeah, seriously. I think they're like, tr <coughs> trying to hint at us. So like, uh, this whole butterfly. Oh, I knew it. Yeah. What a decision that kid had to make. Let's see. Sit quietly in my chair. Bra strap a fucking eight year old. Thank God I chose that. It gave me the white butterfly. I brought friends together. These are third. These are third graders. Yes. Mike's new girlfriend. Confident. Trusting. Irreverent. Creepy smile. Can you please let us out? Pretty please. Mm, do you? Okay. Why wasn't that a decision? Yeah. <laughs> you show off that she's not only ditzy, but a, a bitch. bitch. That's what I'm saying. Another ten minutes in there, and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, you'll get to that point. Look, got a lot of meat on my bones. 
This is all muscle down here. Yeah, right. I think he's me, actually. My goodness. Man, this guy's making all kinds of bad butterfly decisions. Our good friend and dear class president Michael Monroe. Oh god. Class Perez. Of course he is. Of course he is. He's either the quarterback or the class Perez. What do you want to do? I'll explain. I'm Mike and I'm split. We're together. Okay. Alright, alright. Let's just get up to the bottom. You're already getting tired of all this nature for sure. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. Uh. I think she's you. You would appreciate nature. I'd be like, let's get up to the <laughs> cabin. Fuck nature, I want to take a shit. Emily, Enter. Mike's ex. Yep. Intelligent, resourceful, persuasive. Matt, Emily's new boyfriend. Motivated, Motivated. ambitious, active. <laughs> oh, okay, hello. Jesus! He's the douche, obviously. Intelligent, driven, persuasive. Douche. We're all friends here, right? No, we didn't invite you. Spirit thing. So what are you gonna do? Come on, Jared, make the right decision. Oh my God! You know, come on, you push over. This is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Yeah. Mm. Wow. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. Mm. So we're good. All good. You guys can. Should have just out punched out. him. Hey, could you take these the rest? See, of the she's gonna make you carry all her shit. Yeah. I feel like all the bags. Bags. I was, was going to carry all the bags anyway, no matter what I did. Matt, please. Here's decision time. Fuck you! I'm not leaving you alone! <laughs> or a green go. Just make the pussy decision. Yep, there you go. Alright. <sighs> Excuse me? If you know what I mean. I'll think about it. See, no! See you up there, sweetie. Sweetie. <laughs> That should have been decision time. I'll think about it. No, decision time would be like, no, bitch, you owe me. You know, that would be decision time right there. It should have been. And Preston, then, people wonder why you're still single. You, If you manned up, you would get a white butterfly for being a man, okay? For manning up. Did you actually do that? Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, hello. 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 Somebody's getting a little friendly. Yeah. Talking uh, to Sam, huh? So I'm kind of like... See what you did? You're a pushover, so she went right back to the douche. <laughs> it's just like real life. <coughs> what are you looking at? Okay, what do you want to do? Encourage. Do you want to show him that his girlfriend's not o not over her ex, or do you want to mislead him? Oh, jeez. Now, now there's <laughs> a moral decision for you. Honesty or a white lie to save the boy? That is... That's a tough one. Make your call. Come on. Oh, have at it. No, oh, oh, you wanted to play this. <laughs> Actually, I made you play it. But still, you want to make good decisions, make a good decision. Do the moral moral thing and let him take a look? Or do the nice thing. What do you want to do? Oh, God. <laughs> I can't say it's busted because I was, I was just looking just... through it. So what do you do? Um. Oh, my God, you went that route. Oh, you got a white butterfly now. Go ahead. Go ahead. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, shit. I didn't choose this. Oh. Oh, damn. Oh, we got Springer up in here. What the hell, man? Well, this certainly is gonna affect the relationship a bit. But you got a white butterfly! Check the phone. <laughs> oh. oh, here we go. Put your hands where I can see They're about to have a sexy snowball fight. Check it out. What do you do? Run the bench or grab snowball? Quick, quick, you're timed. Okay, you grab snowball, okay. Well, at least you're fighting back. Oh, get him, get him, get him! Yeah, fuck him up! Oh, oh man! Oh, headshot! <laughs> he's coming, he's coming! Hiding. Don't you call me chickeny, bitch! Oh! Hi. There you go. Hey. Uh oh, 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 square! Oh, oh, man, you're winning! Don't hit the bird, don't hit the bird. There you go, you got him, you got him. Mmm, man, you suck! Sometimes doing, doing nothing is the right thing Okay, do. so in this case, don't hit the bird, yeah. Doing nothing is the right thing. If it was- I'm glad you're controlling, because if it was me, I'd hit the bird. Yeah, there you go. Good decision. Good decision. Bird goes, you get a white butterfly. Oh, now you hit him. And then you get a white butterfly for fucking up your boyfriend. <laughs> Keep 
gives you the most hard on? <laughs> Obviously, it's <laughs> men. Men worry me, women. How do you choose? <laughs> nah, what the hell? I'll just pick women. Guns are scary, knives are scary. They're both scary. Can I just choose both? Uh, no, choose one. Um, Would you rather get stabbed or shot? <laughs> That's the option. I'd rather get shot, so knives scare me. Ugh. Scarecrow's a clown. Well, clowns. if you're putting it that way. Clowns. Gore. Gore? Yeah. Alright. Yeah, I guess, yeah. Did I startle you? Yes. So sorry. Then what was the point of that, you dick? Speed up. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be. So he's trying to speed up your heart now by doing the metronome. You have that pacing going on. So. Spiders. Yeah, okay, so Snakes finally loses. Hmm. Needles. Needles or gore? Needles. Needles? Okay. This is interesting, because I'm learning a lot about J-Dog, so zombies. I know what to scare him with. Oh, come on, zombies! Zombies are cool! This is very interesting. Hmm, yes. I know what to scare you with later. Thank you for answering. Yeah. <laughs> that movement of the tongue is creepy. I know. Spiders? Zombies? Yeah, needles. Hmm. I must create something out of that. What kind of Friday nights have you been having, buddy? Uh, well, oh. well, I'm afraid, once again, we're out of time. No, tell me! What kind of Friday nights have you been having? Josh, Hannah and Beth's brother. Complex, thoughtful, loving. Robotic. There's another way in. There are a million ways in, they're just all locked. That's deep, man. Are you saying we should break in? <laughs> Into my own house. I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey. Not if I don't and like, hey. you. And he was like, hey. He was like, hey. Lead the way, coaches. Hi, Chris. What do you want to do? I nice said a little confident. So. So. How are you doing? Good. Hi. Right. A little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Mm hmm. Yeah. That does sound pretty nice. I'll see you inside after I co-cheese my way in.